All right, now, I think you use the whistle in teaching. I believe you use the whistle. A long, a, a short whistle just stops the action. A long whistle is a teaching point. When I have a long whistle, I want you to, whether you have the ball or not, chin the basketball. Chin the basketball so you can, I can check your position. If you don't have the basketball, you imagine you're chinning the basketball. If you have the ball, you stop and chin. So listen for the long whistle. If the long whistle comes, then everybody's down in that position. And it has to be instantaneously. You can't do it slowly. It's got to be a game of balance and quickness. Then you can see immediately whether they know to keep their elbows up, whether they've got their fingers up, and squeezing the ball so that I can't get the ball. Okay, relax. All right, so when you hear a long whistle anytime, chin the basketball. Use that as a teaching tool. All right, now we'll go two dribbles. Two dribbles. Now let's use your non-preferred hand to dribble now. Ready? Okay, relax. Okay, now you have to be balanced and quick and do it at any time you want to do that. Ready? Way too slow. Relax. Before you can be quick, you've got to think quick. Ready? Good. All right, go. Non-preferred hand. Two dribbles. Two dribbles. Catch the ball with your feet in the air. The bad pass. Hit it. Good. Good. All right, relax and listen. All right, now, you can teach everything out of this drill.